Grandmas and grandpas the world over are all the same. When they meet their grandbabies for the first time, it registers off the charts on the emotional scale. And for good reason. Lucky for you, we managed to capture these touching moments so you can join in on the love. Get your Kleenex ready because we're about to begin. Being separated from your family for two and a half years, only to return with a baby in your arms, can bring any reunion to a higher level. Although, don't be surprised if Grandpa is more excited to meet his first grandchild. That comes with the territory. Grandma finally gets to lay her eyes on her first grandbaby, you never know what's going to come out of her mouth. In this case, thanking the Lord for this tremendous blessing is completely acceptable. Eleven years is a long time to wait to meet your grandson in person, but the explosion of joy between them when they finally get to wrap their arms around each other beats chatting on a screen any day. Honoring your father for all he did to raise you upright is a wonderful thing to do. But the ultimate nod has to be naming your child after him. That's the ultimate Father's Day gift that will last a generation. Any old timer can be forgiven for breaking out into tears at the sight of their first grandchild. It's quite touching to see how lucky that little baby is to be born into a family with so much love to give. It's great to see that the only thing greater than a grandma's love is a great grandma's love. My grandma flew out to meet her first great grandbaby. Her reaction is priceless. Oh my god. Oh my god. Let's all watch the exact moment this couple goes from parents to grandparents. And the t-shirts are a nice touch just goes to show their level of preparedness. You know they've been waiting anxiously for this moment, and here it is.
just imagine the feeling of waiting on the other side of the hospital doors, waiting to see your grandchild for the first time. Then the door swings open, and your world will never be the same again. There is a house built out. <laughs> I wonder what was going through her head on that 10 hour drive to meet her great grandchild. I wonder if she even noticed the time passing by. She probably stepped into the car, blinked her eyes, and was transported instantly to look into her great grandson's beautiful blue eyes. <laughs> Grandpas love to dote on their grandchildren. It's like a rule. But if your grandson is named after you, I wonder if that turns the dial up on the spoiling meter a bit. I think so, but the question is, how much? The pandemic was a crazy time. Unfortunately, it led to many grandparents having to delay their first meeting with their grandchildren. That just made it that much more sweet and memorable when that day finally arrived. Grandma here has been waiting a few years to finally be able to give her grandson a big hug. But when that day finally arrived, I'm not sure who was more excited, Grandma or the dog. <laughs> Toughest, manliest grandpas can be forgiven for getting emotional when they meet their grandson for the first time. That macho exterior just falls away quick as can be, and for the moment, life will never be as good as this. <laughs> What better gift for your 77th birthday than to be introduced to your new grandchild? 
All the gifts, vacation, and money in the world couldn't compare to that feeling inside when you lock eyes for the first time. There are a few kinds of surprises. There's mild, there's shocking, there's unwanted, and even bewildering to name a few. But the best kind is a total surprise. Like when you didn't even know your daughter gave birth already and wham, you've got a grandson in your arms. Hold your hands out. Oh, What? I had a baby. <laughs> no, you didn't. I did. Why didn't you say anything? I wanted it to be a surprise. Oh my god. What did you do? What did you do? Hey, Glenda. What are you doing? Hey, Glenda. Hey, yeah. What do you do when your grandson walks in the house with a child of their own? You do the only thing a great grandma can do in that situation. Let loose with the tears of joy. Question. How do you double the emotions when introducing your newborn to their grandparents for the first time? Answer. You simply double up the grandparents and introduce them all at once. Saves time and makes for a great video. She's a hoss. She's six pounds. Thanks for watching. Don't feel bad if you cried a time or two. That just means you're human. Please hit the like button and be sure to subscribe. There's plenty more where this came from. See you next time.